The former Strictly Come Dancing presenter was surrounded by his family, including wife Will Nelia, at the time of his death. Following the news of the dead of SIXS passing, his family shared a short statement. In the message, given to the BBC, they thanked the many people who have sent cards and letters to Bruce wishing him well over his long illness and know that they will share in part, the great, great loss they feel. They added there would be no further comment at the moment and asked for their privacy to be respected at this most difficult time. His manager, Ian Wilson, added it is with a great sadness that the Forsyth family announced that Sir Bruce passed away this afternoon, peacefully at his home surrounded by his wife Will Neely and all his children. A couple of weeks ago, a friend visited him and asked him what he had been doing these last 18 months. With a twinkle in his eye, he responded I've been very, very busy, being ill Bruce had been unwell for some time, previously spending time in hospital for a severe chest infection. He had not been seen in public recently, due to his ill health. The star's long-running showbiz career started back when he was just 14. The silver-haired entertainer hosted primetime game shows, including The Generation Game, Play Your Cards Right, and The Price is Right. He most recently presented Strictly Come Dancing, alongside Tess Daly, for 10 years. Tributes from famous faces, including his co-stars, poured in following news of his death. Dear Sir Bruce, truly natural magical entertainer, so wonderful with his audiences, in his words you're my favorite rip, Zoe Ball tweeted. Dermot Ollery shared an Instagram post, with the caption so sad to hear about Bruce. One of the godfathers, quick of wit, fleet of foot, always had a smile and a quip. Just a lovely man, X, and Claudia Winkleman, who took over from Bruce on Strictly, added he was the king of TV, the prince of performers and the most generous of people, all toe-tapping twinkle, all kindness, all love. The Bruce you saw really was the man he was. Well miss him so much.